What's good YouTube, it's your boy Des Honcho. In today's video, we will be breaking down how to edit like Can Can Videographer. This is his style of editing right here. So basically, his style of editing is a bunch of fast with a bunch of motion blur, blur, flash. Today's video, we will be breaking it down how he does it. Let's get right in. What's good YouTube, in today's video, I will be teaching you how to edit like this. So in today's video, that's what we'll be breaking down. We'll be breaking down how to edit like Can Can Videographer, how to add a lot of motion and a lot of motion blurs and stuff like that. So let's get right into the video. How I did it. Let me give you a, a bonus tip on how this is done and how this is made easier. So basically, it's a bunch of zoom ins and zoom outs, pretty much. So, but what will help with is, for example, I'm about to give you a prime example right now. So y'all can understand what I'm saying. All right. So the tip. That's going to make this this effect and this uh, whatever easier. Long story short, say if I was to zoom in, nine times out of ten, I'm already zooming in with the camera as I'm shooting. So this clip right here, boom. This transition clip, I had a flash like he does. And after this clip, look how fast it zooms out. Look how fast it zooms out. You see that? This zooms all the way out. That's just not a transform effect. That's also me doing this. So it's like times two the fucking zoom out. And then the next clip, same thing. Watch the next clip. And zooms out crazy because I'm doing it myself. Okay. Boom. So besides that, that's the bonus tip on how to sell this effect and get this effect to look fucking crazy. So for in his videos, he does a lot of uh, the transitions are a lot of flashes and blurs. So to get that, here go one clip. All I did was nest these two. So, boom, I took the two of these, nested them. Let me show you how I did it. So, this is originally like this. I go over one frame, two frame, cut, one, two, one, two, cut, nest. Once you nest it, I don't know if y'all have it, but you could, you could throw any blur on there, but I think I have. Once again, you can get all of this stuff for free. It's cracked. You can get all these, like, sapphire. I got a sapphire crack. Don't tell nobody, but. So, boom. Take the sapphire crack. Throw it on there. Now you got you a nice little blur. Now it's like this. Nice little blur. Or, what I did was, most of them, is I threw on a, uh, a glow. That's what I'm going to say. A glow is nice. So, this is how it looks before. Transition nice and ass. You throw that motherfucking glow in there. Spice them up. So he does a lot of glows, transitions also, and a lot of zoom in and zooms out. And then he also does um, to get the zoom in and zoom out so perfectly. Let me show you how I do that too. This is the one that I showed y'all that I zoomed without crazy. So I'm gonna show you how I look the clip looked before this. So so this is how the clip looked before this. So it's zoomed out. It's already naturally zoomed out. But when you just add that transform and all I did was for the transform is so all I did was go to the beginning of my clip all I did was go to the beginning of my clip keyframe boom you don't need to keep anchor points position scale shutter angle now you don't need to position that but the shutter angle gives you motion blur 360 give you motion blur so boom put that 360 now, how you sell an effect is you want to start your clip off zoomed in on your wherever you want to be on. Boom. Now, look extra zoomed out. Now, we can go over here, reset the keyframes. Boom. Drag these to the end of the clip. Now, look at this. Hold on. Let me render it out. Fucking computer. So, basically, this is how the clips look now. So it's extra zoomed out. Look at that. The motion blur, but I should look here. Get right to the transition with the flash. So this, I didn't want to make the video long or nothing because what he does is really not too crazy, but. Damn, I feel like I explained this so ass. 
So yeah, that's what he does. Boom, he zooms out a lot like this. And just for the opposite, if he's zooming in. So in his video, he's like to do a lot of a uh, shake. To get that shake, all you gotta do is type in shake on any fuck. There's a bunch of shakes. Mm. Premiere. Drag it on there. Should be good to go. Alright, so that's how to edit like Can Can's videographer. I know it wasn't the best video, but I hope y'all enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, comment, subscribe. Let's go.